Three, two, one, action. What's going on, guys? Can you see my here and welcome to another video? In this video, we'll be looking at my custom Yoletti Buffalo. So, this is a transport vehicle, if you can't tell, and it is on the base of the other transport vehicle, which I've got over here. It is based off of this one, which is pretty much fully equipped because I have it used in the mock right now. So basically take the turret and all the cargo off the back. But that is what it's based off. Anyway. That, that's what it is based off. That transport vehicle right there. So I made many modifications to this. So let's get into it. Firstly, let's look at the front. Uh, nothing really done to the front except I have added this little roof bit. Check it on the final model, looks quite good. So I feel like the other roof doesn't have a stud here. That one is kind of cut off. You can't really see that well because it blends in. So, I might be able to see it better when I move around. So next, I added on these sides, which is the main reason why I built this room. So I got this in the haul that I did, or that I purchased, and I just decided to upgrade it. So it's got more armor on the side. Also has a bigger cargo bay. Which I don't know if you see that well, but quite a bigger cargo bay. Let's take out the top couple of steps to fit the brace in, otherwise it will just keep falling apart. Just have the little bike bits on the back. Also got these. Bits on the side which I added with just some studs on the side. Like that. Got all those. Yep, I used the base that has Kelly in, the UNC fire base for this. And then you see the stickers on there from they were I believe they were somewhere there. I'll take them off and put them there. And I also added mod flaps on the back, right there. You can't really see that well. Hold on. Full focus. You can kind of see it. It's not focusing. Hold on. Can't focus. It's only focusing on my finger. Oh, uh, yeah, you can kind of see it. Once again, I use the UNSC Firebase to do this. Uh, it holds quite a lot more cargo now. That was my main goal, make it into a bigger cargo transport. Uh, the other one could only hold what could fit like in the full stud base. But this one has double, well, just under double that, so it's got six there, but you could use figures as well. So it kind of has an A stud base. So that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.